Hello and welcome to ABC News, I'm Ros Childs. Official documents have revealed Peter Dutton as Immigration Minister acted against the advice of his department in approving a visa to a French nanny. Political editor Andrew Proben has more from Canberra. This is the, uh, the case of the Home Affairs Minister the au pair and the AFL boss. Now, let's. I think before we go into uh, this this drop of documents that's uh, turned up in Labor's hands, a series of emails that's quite lengthy. Um, perhaps we should explain what this is all about, and uh, if uh, viewers can might be able to recall that this is the case of Alexandra Duell, who was wanting to work as an au pair for the McLaughlin family in Adelaide, Callum and Sky McLaughlin. Now, she turned up on an Emirates flight at Adelaide Airport late October uh, 2015 and Border Force officials believed that she was going to be breaching her visa uh, and that is that she shouldn't be working. Now, they did interview her and she admitted that she was going to uh, work voluntarily for Callum and Sky McLaughlin. Her visa was uh, struck out immediately and she was told that she was going to be sent back to France. Now, some phone calls were made. Uh, Callum uh, McLaughlin rang uh, and emailed his cousin, second cousin, Gillen McLaughlin, who's the AFL boss, and his office contacted Peter Dutton's office uh, chief of staff by the name of Craig McLaughlin. A lot of McLaughlins, but that one's not related. Now, what then happened was that there was uh, consideration from the, uh, from the department itself. Uh, briefs were sought from the department, and we now know um, that uh, very high-level officials, Border Force officials, in fact, uh, uh, Assistant Commissioner for Strategic Border Command, Clive Murray, advised that Ms Duell had been previously counselled in uh, May 2015 about breaching her visa conditions, um, that there might be some financial liability for the department if she was allowed to stay, uh, and that uh, he, the, the department would provide to the minister some detail that does not support the minister intervening. Now, uh, despite that, uh, we had a situation that we discovered where Ms Duell uh, was allowed to stay. Uh, some documents were, were got to uh, Peter Dutton by about nine, at least 9.30, or no later than 9.30 p.m. that night, because he was about to fly, fly out to the Middle East, and she was allowed to stay. So Labor is saying, well, you know, uh, is... Uh, are there any links to uh, uh, political donations here? Uh, that's already been rejected by Peter Dutton. That uh, The fact that uh, Callum McLaughlin's father, Hugh McLaughlin, is a very big uh, Liberal Party donor, had nothing to do with this. Uh, he says that uh, uh, it, was, uh, it was all on the merits of the case. And Andrew Peter Dutton has been talking about this on the radio. What's he said? Well, he, he did. He's, he's obviously talked about this a couple of times this week. He went on 2GB and he said that it was a bit rough. He said that he was a man of integrity and that his decision about Ms Duell was based on the merits of the case, not the knowledge of the person who referred it to it. And uh, as I understand it, he said she never overstayed the, her visa, hasn't committed any criminal offences, and I thought it was an application of common sense. But vow, uh, Labor is vowing to, to take this. Uh, further. Uh, they have a Senate inquiry uh, uh, the, on this matter and, and that is why this document, um, this extraordinary uh, detailed uh, emails uh, were, were sent to Labor's uh, Kimberly Kitching. Uh, she's on the committee and there will be no doubt a lot of questions asked. Thanks Andrew. Thanks Ros.